Okay, so as you can see, um, we started graveling. Uh, what we've done, we've put a weed membrane down. As you can see, we've pegged it down um, quite a lot, all the way, all the way along. A lot of gardens that we go to where people have done fabric themselves, we often find that they don't peg it down. By doing this, you're effectively not really doing anything because the weeds will just push themselves right through the fabric. So it's really important to peg it down quite firmly. So you can see we've left a little bit of a gap because we've still got to do this half. And when you're laying fabric, you need to give a really good overlap. So when we lay the next bit here, we'll probably overlap it by about that, that much so you don't get um, a gap in between. Um, so the gravel that we've gone for um, is quite a large gravel, um, so it'll make it a little bit easier for the customers to walk on and get their wheelbarrow over. Um, we've gone for sort of with some dark elements in, so light and dark. The light to contrast with the dark, but the dark to, to bring out the, the colour of the stone. So I think it's uh, starting to look, look all right anyway. Um, so then panning round, it's still a little bit messy at the moment, but we've uh, put the trellis up. So if you're looking from the angle of the house, it hides the shed quite nicely. Um, as you can see, we've painted one of them. I've got the other one to paint today. We've gone for a really dark stain um, and we're gonna paint the box the same color. Because of this being a natural wood, we didn't want it to look too sort of natural wood and we wanted that to tie into the fence panel. So hopefully if, if uh, it dries up this afternoon, um, I'll be able to paint uh, the other side of the trellis. Uh, obviously the only problem with it raining, wood takes a le very long time to dry out and it's still quite quite wet today. But if I get a chance, um, then I'll do that later. So today, this is the timber that we've got for the box that we're going to build. So basically we're going to build a box that comes out here all the way along, um, quite relatively deep, probably about 50 by 50 centimetres. So we can get some nice planting in there and a couple of climbers that eventually it'll go up the trellis to hide there so the aim today is to get that completed um, hopefully get the rest of the membrane down and the rest of the gravel um, put down planting wise um, we've got a nice big olive coming this afternoon uh, I couldn't get it in my little van so that's a job for Adam later but I've got some nice box balls uh, and they're going to go in this border here which will be quite good um, I've also got some bone meal um, to pop in the bottom it's really important um, it helps basically establish the root system which is key um, you want a really really good root system and then you'll have healthy growth so putting a really good handful of bone meal in the bottom when you're planting any shrubs is a really good idea because it just gives them a boost uh, that's where the olive tree will be going later so I'll give you an update on that um, so basically that's where we're at at the moment so I'll just keep you in the loop uh, speak to you later. Bye.